Well, you hear it all the time with those big lottery winners, right? They choose to take that lump sum instead of the yearly payout because a big pile of cash all at once sounds fun, right? But should you treat your pension like a lottery windfall? Surprisingly, more and more retirees are having to make that decision, and it's one that you should only make after getting expert advice. I'm president of Safe Harbor Retirement here to talk with me, Corey Sickles. This is a decision I think more and more people are having to make these days. Corey, we're talking about pensions, so thanks for being here. Yeah, no problem, Robin. It is something that comes up a lot more. I think these companies that have pension plans are really trying to get out of it. You know, it's their obligation. As long as you live, they have to keep paying it. People that do have pensions, you know, everyone, you know, new employees don't have them. But a lot of the baby boomers do, and I think you're going to see some options for them to be able to take a lump sum or get a lifetime income. So then let's talk about that. These are two very different options people have to face. So what would someone need to consider um, to make either of those decisions? Yeah, so let's talk a little bit first just about the monthly payment. Um, I mean, everyone understands that, right? You're guaranteed a monthly payment as long as, 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 long as you live. Um, you know, there, the one thing I think you do need to really consider about that, though, is you're only, you know, you're only guaranteed that payment as long as that company's still in business. So that's one thing to really think about. And the other part, when you start thinking about taking a lump sum pension, is you're, that payment's more than likely not going to change. Once you elect to take that pension, you might not be able to get any type of increase to keep up with inflation. We've talked about inflation, you know, on previous shows as well. You want to look at longevity, right? So between those two options, I mean, if you take the lump sum, I know a lot of the concern is that then you have this money and you're going to spend it all right away. But but you sit down with people and come up with a plan, right? Either way, whatever decision they make. Everyone's situation is different. You know, if you need this amount of pension money in order, you know, uh, in order to maybe guarantee your monthly budget when you include Social Security and some other things, then taking the monthly pension payment might be the right thing. But you know, if if you do have a little bit of flexibility, it could a lot, you know, it could make a lot more sense to take the lump sum because now you get to it's going to give you a lot more flexibility. You're going to be able to choose how you want to invest that. Um, maybe your payments will increase as you age. And I think another thing to always think about, too, you know, talk about long, longevity, right? You know, if all of a sudden you're, you're getting that monthly payment and then you pass away, it ends. So you could have you know, worked for this company for 35, 30 to 35 years, three years into this, the thing ends, where if you took a lump sum, now you at least have something to also pass on to you know, your beneficiaries. Okay, so yeah, there are a lot of things to consider, ins and outs, and I'm sure you sit down with people every day and have to make this choice. I mean, is this where you make kind of a pros and cons? This is what we see in either way? Yeah, I, th I think before you make the decision, it's really wise to sit down with a financial professional like, you know, like myself so we can actually put together an income or a retirement plan for you. It's really more of a strategy. And at the end of the day, I have a fiduciary responsibility you know, to my clients. So I'm going to recommend which is best for you, whether that is potentially taking you know, that monthly payment or whether it is to take the lump sum and you know, do something with that. But again, everyone's situation is different. I think it's wise to you know, take an hour of your time and, you know, had that complimentary meeting with me. Yeah, because like you mentioned, I mean, once you make that choice, that's set in stone. So you got to be sure about that choice. Corey, let us know how your consultations are working these days. We know they're always complimentary. Yeah. So, of course, we can always meet, you know, face to face. We have two locations, one in Easton and one in Dublin. But if you want to, we can still meet via Zoom or we can even do a conference call. But again, all meetings are complimentary. Uh, whether it's the first meeting, second meeting, or third meeting, you know, it's really what we're trying to do is help, you know, our clients prepare for retirement. And the best way to really do that is to make sure you have an income plan or a retirement plan in place. And always smart to get a second opinion, as we've talked about before as well. So definitely when it comes to your money, be smart about it. Safeharboroh.com is the website. Corey, thank you. Thank you, Robin.